Jones. You see them blocking and moving around, jockeying for position just now. Got it gets away. Tyler Reddick's got the push of Ty Dillon. We've seen that bottom lane is just a sitting duck on the restarts. Three wide down into turn three again. Oh. oh, we got one around. Ty Dillon into the one, hard into the wall. Nelly wow. and Sadler caught up the one car. And a lot more damage. Cars getting into the grass, and we know that there's so much moisture in the grass tearing cars apart. We were, they were covering our inside. Gloves off. It's going to be the end of the day for the one Elliott Sadler. Heavy, heavy contact. Two wide is one thing, three I wide where is I can go, man. so much more difficult. Super heavy damage here, guys. Just be ready. The 12 also involved. That's Austin Cedric. Damage on that car looks like maybe he was one of the cars that went in the grass. I'll have to see the replay to confirm, but that grass, you mentioned it, Rick, inches of rain. It, it's, it looks green, but we know it is soft and muddy underneath it. Just pulls the cars in, tears the noses off. Meteorologist said that over the last four days, it has rained almost five inches here in Indianapolis. So they wanted to avoid getting into the grass, but this was, this was three cars fighting for real estate, and it wasn't there. Yeah, so we saw... The three of Ty Dillon had the front row for the start, but just didn't get going. He was backing up, and here he is three wide. The 42 of John Hunter makes a nice pass around the outside, and almost like the air just pulls the three around. He spins out basically by himself in the middle of three wide. As he comes around, he makes contact with the one. This shot right here, look at the safer barrier. Elliott Sadler up. Man, that's a hard impact. It's safer barrier doing its job was giving these cars a run in fifth and seventh at the time of the accident. And then you see the 76, my goodness, parts flying off that car as he went through the grass to try to avoid the cars in front of him. Yeah, that's 76, Remember that, Spencer Boyd. That three at tight end was on two tires. I don't know if that has anything to do with this accident, whether it was aerodynamics, whether it was just a bad place. We'll have to ask Ty when we get to speak to him later, but basically spins out in the middle of three wide collects Elliott Sadler, really nowhere to go, running by himself at the bottom. 16 of Ryan Reed also got caught up in this. Got tagged by the one. Right there. There's the 12. So the 12 didn't spin. You already see the damage. That tells me that came from the grass. And we'll ride along with Elliott Sadler. And the one car. Three by two. Three wide. One outside. One outside. pusher behind you. It's two back to two wide. Good to push hard when you get there. Nothing in front of double zero. Outside line. Here comes the run behind you. Big run behind you. Still three wide. Clear high. Inside. Inside, inside, inside. Oh, we were screwed there. That's Brett Griffin's voice. We actually had dinner with Brett Griffin yesterday, and this is a difficult situation for the one of Elliott Sadler. Announced his retirement earlier just a couple weeks ago, not the way he wanted to end his last race at Indy. Parker. Well, Rick, and one thing I noticed there is, is twofold. One, you're three wide in the middle where you've got no side force on the right side. You're, you're lacking downforce because you're in a pack like that where Ty Dillon was. But 